Aerial view of the barren landscape surrounding Area 51, Nevada. Welcome to the enigmatic world of Area 51, a place shrouded in secrecy and speculation, where conspiracy theories abound and the truth remains elusive. Join us as we embark on a journey to uncover the secrets of this mysterious military installation and explore the theories surrounding its alleged connection to extraterrestrial life. The Birth of Area 51 Our journey begins in the desolate desert of Nevada, where in the 1950s, the United States government established a top-secret military base known as Area 51. Nestled within the expansive Nevada Test and Training Range, Area 51 was initially used for testing experimental aircraft and weapons technology during the Cold War. Its remote location, and restricted access made it the perfect site for conducting classified research away from prying eyes. The Roswell Incident No exploration of Area 51 would be complete without delving into the infamous Roswell Incident of 1947. According to conspiracy theorists, an unidentified flying object UFO crashed near Roswell, New Mexico, and was recovered by the military. Witnesses claimed to have seen alien bodies among the wreckage, sparking rumors of a government cover-up and the secret transport of the debris to Area 51 for analysis. While official reports attributed the incident to a crashed weather balloon, many believe that the truth remains hidden within the walls of Area 51. Reverse Engineering one of the most enduring conspiracy theories surrounding Area 51 is that it serves as a hub for reverse engineering extraterrestrial technology. Proponents of this theory claim that recovered alien spacecraft and artifacts are housed within the base's clandestine facilities, where scientists work tirelessly to unlock their secrets. From advanced propulsion systems to cutting-edge weaponry, the ALLEGD fruits of this reverse engineering endeavor are said to be years ahead of anything known to the public. Bob Lazar's testimony. Central to the lore of Area 51 is the testimony of Bob Lazar, a former employee who claimed to have worked on alien spacecraft at the base. In a series of interviews in the late 1980s, Lazar described his alleged experiences with remarkable detail recounting his involvement in back-engineering extraterrestrial technology and witnessing otherworldly phenomena. While Lazar's claims have been met with skepticism and scrutiny, they continue to captivate the imagination of UFO enthusiasts and conspiracy theorists alike. The Jana Flights Operating out of McCarran International Airport in Las Vegas the Jana flights are a fleet of unmarked aircraft that shuttle employees to and from Area 51. These mysterious flights, often referred to as Jana Airlines, are believed to transport personnel and supplies to the highly secure base on a daily basis. Despite their regular sightings, little is known about the passengers or cargo aboard these flights fueling speculation about their connection to Area 51's clandestine activities. Extraterrestrial Biology Lab According to some conspiracy theories, Area 51 houses a top-secret biology lab dedicated to the study of extraterrestrial life forms. Proponents of this theory claim that captured aliens are kept in containment facilities within the base, where they are subjected to scientific experimentation and analysis. Tales of alien autopsies, genetic manipulation, and even hybridization have circulated within UFO circles, painting a chilling picture of the potential horrors concealed within Area 51's walls. The Men in Black No exploration of Area 51 would be complete without a mention of the infamous Men in Black, shadowy figures said to enforce secrecy surrounding UFO sightings and extraterrestrial encounters. According to eyewitness accounts, these mysterious individuals often appear unannounced to intimidate witnesses into silence, using intimidation tactics and psychological manipulation to suppress the truth. 
While skeptics dismiss the men in black as urban legend, their presence looms large in the lore of Area 51 and the wider UFO community. The War Project Among the many covert operations rumored to be conducted at Area 51 is the Aurora Project, an alleged black budget program focused on developing advanced aerospace technologies. Conspiracy theorists speculate that the Aurora Project is responsible for the creation of hypersonic aircraft stealth drones, and other cutting-edge platforms capable of outperforming conventional aircraft. While evidence of the project's existence remains scat, reports of mysterious aircraft sightings in the vicinity of Area 51 have fueled speculation about its true nature and objectives. The Freedom Ridge Standoff In the early 1990s, tensions between the public and the government reached a boiling point when activists and UFO enthusiasts staged a series of protests near Area 51's perimeter. The most notable of these protests occurred at Freedom Ridge, a popular vantage point overlooking the base where civilians gathered to observe military activity. The standoff between protesters and security personnel attracted international media attention shedding light on the secrecy surrounding Area 51 and fueling speculation about what lay hidden within its confines. The Groom Lake Facility At the heart of Area 51 lies the Groom Lake Facility, a highly restricted compound rumored to house some of the base's most sensitive operations. Surrounded by razor wire fences, motion sensors, and armed guards, Groom Lake is off-limits to all but those with the highest security clearance. Speculation abounds about what goes on behind its fortified walls, with theories ranging from advanced weapons testing to extraterrestrial research. Despite its aura of secrecy, Groom Lake continues to intrigue and mystify those who seek to uncover the truth about Area 51. The Alien Autopsy Footage one of the most controversial pieces of evidence purported to come out of Area 51 is the infamous alien autopsy footage. Allegedly filmed in the 1940s, the grainy black and white footage purportedly shows the examination of an extraterrestrial corpse recovered from the Roswell crash site. While skeptics dismiss the footage as a hoax, claiming it was staged for entertainment purposes, Believers argue that it provides compelling evidence of government involvement in UFO cover-ups and alien contact. The Black Mailbox Standing alone in the desolate Nevada desert, the Black Mailbox has become an iconic symbol of Area 51 lore. Located along State Route 375, also known as the Extraterrestrial Highway, the mailbox served as a meeting point for UFO enthusiasts and conspiracy theorists hoping to catch a glimpse of mysterious aircraft flying over the base. While the original black mailbox was replaced with a white one due to vandalism and theft, its legend lives on as a testament to the enduring fascination with Area 51 and the unknown. The Camo Dudes Patrolling the perimeter of Area 51 are the Camo Dudes, a private security force tasked with keeping prying eyes at bay. Armed with binoculars, camouflage gear, and an intimidating demeanor, these security personnel are known for their no-nonsense approach to enforcing the base's boundaries. Despite their clandestine nature, the Camo Dudes have become something of a legend among UFO enthusiasts who often engage in cat-and-mouse games with them in hopes of catching a glimpse of Area 51 secrets. The Foo Fighters During World War II, Allied pilots reported encounters with mysterious aerial phenomena they dubbed Foo Fighters. These unidentified flying objects, described as glowing orbs or balls of light, were often sighted near aircraft during combat missions. While explanations for the Foo Fighters range from secret Nazi weapons to atmospheric phenomena, some speculate that they may have been early sightings of experimental aircraft being tested at Area 51. The truth behind the Foo Fighters remains a subject of debate and speculation to this day. The Dreamland Resort 
Nestled in the shadow of the Nevada mountains lies the Dreamland Resort, a secluded lodging facility rumored to cater to Area 51 employees and visitors. Despite its remote location and unassuming appearance, the Dreamland Resort has become a focal point for UFO enthusiasts and conspiracy theorists seeking a glimpse behind the veil of secrecy surrounding the base. While access to the resort is strictly controlled, its existence serves as a reminder of the human presence that lurks in the shadows of Area 51. The Phoenix Lights In March 1997, thousands of witnesses in Arizona reported seeing a series of strange lights. In the night sky, which came to be known as the Phoenix Lights, while officials attributed the phenomenon to military flares or atmospheric conditions. Many believe that the lights were a mass sighting of extraterrestrial craft visiting Earth. Some conspiracy theorists speculate that the Phoenix Lights were connected to Area 51, with the base playing a role in coordinating or concealing the mysterious aerial display. To this day, the Phoenix Lights remain one of the most compelling UFO sightings in modern history. The Dulce Base Connection Venturing beyond the confines of Area 51, we encounter another enigmatic installation. Rumored to be connected to extraterrestrial activity, the Dulce Base. Located beneath the Arcoleta Mesa in New Mexico, the Dulce Base is said to house a joint human-alien research facility where clandestine experiments are conducted on both humans and extraterrestrial beings. Some conspiracy theorists speculate that Area 51 and the Dulce Base are linked by underground tunnels, forming part of a vast network of secret facilities engaged in otherworldly research. The Majestic 12. At the heart of many UFO conspiracy theories lies the shadowy organization known as Majestic 12, allegedly established by President Harry Truman in the aftermath of the Roswell incident. Majestic 12 is said to oversee government efforts to study and cover up evidence of extraterrestrial visitation. According to conspiracy theorists, the group operates in secrecy, wielding immense power and influence over global affairs. While the existence of Majestic 12 remains unconfirmed, its legend looms large in the world of UFO lore, fueling speculation about government involvement in UFO cover-ups and conspiracies. The Disclosure Movement In recent years, a growing number of individuals and organizations have called for government disclosure of classified information related to UFOs and extraterrestrial encounters. Known as the Disclosure Movement, this grassroots effort seeks to shed light on the truth about UFOs and break the silence surrounding government involvement in studying the phenomenon from petitions and protests to Freedom of Information Act requests. Advocates of disclosure are pushing for greater transparency and accountability from those in power. Whether their efforts will lead to full disclosure remains to be seen, but the movement continues to gain momentum as public interest in UFOs reaches new heights. The Search for Answers as we conclude our exploration of Area 51 and the secrets of the extraterrestrial base, one question lingers. What lies beyond the veil of secrecy that shrouds this enigmatic facility? From alleged sightings of UFOs and alien encounters to rumors of reverse-engineered technology and government cover-ups, the mysteries of Area 51 continue to captivate the human imagination inspiring countless theories and speculations. While some dismiss the claims surrounding Area 51 as fanciful fiction, others remain convinced that the truth is out there waiting to be uncovered. Thank you for your support. Please subscribe and like my videos.